So, honey, do you have a quarter? I have a quarter. And why do I need a quarter? Because we're going to Aldi. Hi there, Stephen Pegg from Loves to Travel. Thanks for checking out our videos. Always love it when you watch our videos. Uh, doing a trip to Aldi. Haven't been up here in a bit, so we're going to go up and do a little shopping at Aldi. Main reason we're coming up there, I think, is for lower salt bacon, though, right? Right, and I know you checked a rib roast the other day. Hopefully, they'll have another one. Most uh, likely not. But... And, of course, I pull in the wrong entrance. Um, no, they didn't have any. I came up here earlier this week because they had a rib roast on sale, and they were out of them altogether. Um, before we get started, though, on the video, love for you to hit the subscribe button below if you've not already, already done so. Also, that bell notification button below, because that'll get you notified when we put up future videos. And please hit the like button, too, because that helps us out immensely. I want to look, um, look at the Aldi deals, too, and um, also some of the things in the aisle of shame. So let's get parked. We'll head on into Aldi. I'll use my quarter, and we'll do a little shopping, all right? What did you pay for the pineapple at uh, Kroger the other day? 87 cents. So these are 99 cents, so Kroger is a little cheaper. Yeah, and these are also tinier. Yeah. They have cauliflower. Actually, this is a really good price for cauliflower. I think I bought it for two something. That's a good price, $1.99 for cauliflower. Mm -hmm. They have blueberries for $2.29 rather for mm -hmm. uh, a pint. And celery, $1.29 for a head of celery. Mandarin oranges, $2.99. That's a good price for the mandarin oranges for three pounds. That's a good price for that. And then they have uh, Granny Smith apples, two twenty nine mm -hmm. for a bag of apples. I do like their cookies here. Their cookies are really, really good. The bake shop cookies, yes, they are. The bake shop cookies and the muffins are good. Yep. You can try their garlic bread if you want to try the garlic bread here. We could. How much is the garlic bread? Let's see. Uh, two twenty five. So is that? That's for either the garlic or the. Uh, there's two. There's the garlic and there's parmesan. Uh, they're both two twenty-five. Do you want to try the garlic bread here and see what it's like, rather than the frozen what we normally get? Yeah. Why don't we try that one? It's not sliced. You'd have to slice it yourself. Unless you want to do the garlic knots. Which one? I'd rather do this. Let's just do this. Okay. We'll try that. Yeah, try and see what we like. See if we like it. Uh, the brioche rolls here, by the way, the brioche rolls. I, I'm not sure where they're at, but we got the brioche rolls here the last time. Yeah, here they are, right here. Those are really good. We've had those. Those are really, really, really good. And they're only three sixty nine each. So, mm -hmm. you want to get one? It's up to you. It's up to you. Um, I think we got enough bread right now. But if you want to get the brioche rolls when you come here, those are really good. We discovered the cookies here last time. They sure. taste just like Girl Scout cookies. The peanut butter cookies, the caramel coconut fudge cookies, just like Girl Scout cookies. And uh, unfortunately, it's Girl Scout cookie time, so do we buy these or do we buy Girl Scout cookies? Well, these are $1.39 Girl Scout cookies. I know it's a good for a good cause, but they want $5 per box. I might buy a box just to we will. We'll buy a box. Somewhere along the line. We'll buy a box to donate it. Which is what we'll do. Did you want to check and see if they have one of those roasts here? They didn't have any the other day. Yeah, we could check. Most likely they won't have it. That's one of those deals where they got it and when it's gone, it's gone, right? Yeah. They do have ham here, though. Oh, they may have it here. Is that, is that the one, the eight ninety nine a pound? No, that's a strip. It was six ninety nine. Yeah, they don't have it. Nope. Now that's the half cup strip roast. How much is that? Eight ninety nine. Especially select. That's not a bad price, but it is I'm not. Just to double check this all. Strip roast, 62. 62. And this is boneless, so. That's, four, that's 64. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not, it doesn't look like it's a bad piece of meat either. But no, it does not. We didn't buy the other one from uh, Kroger the other day, so we're probably not going to buy this one, right? We don't know. Let me think about this one. We may buy this one because it's priced really well. Chuck roast. 
Yeah, chuck roast has gone up significantly. That's what we get for pot roast normally, right? Right. Like I said, it's gone up so much. And their chicken breast is a really good price. It is $1.99. See, those went up too. Yeah, they did. Mm -hmm. And we want to check the bacon out. The lower salt bacon is four oh nine a pound. So I'm gonna get some of that. The regular bacon is four forty five, but it looks like they're out. Well that's for the center cut bacon. Right. So we're gonna get the lower salt bacon. Do you yeah. wanna get one or two? Let's see how many they had because remember our pricing of this has been going up. They've got Keep a going. they got a bunch okay. of the lower salt. Keep going. Do three or four. Keep going. Oh, so we just we freeze them. Okay, we'll do four. Always look Let's at the back, the back side. Let's look at the backs. If we don't like the backs, then we'll check the back. other ones. Yeah, oh, there we go. Good. Remember, we've been having trouble finding bacon. Yeah, and lower salt bacon for us is a must, to be honest with you. I, I love bacon, but the lower salt for us is a must. Remember, there's also a different price of bacon. There is the thick slice for 815 the Apple Farm Center Cut for $4.45. The value economy price bacon by Jamestown is $3.79. They have Appleton's Thick Cut $4.09. They have Appleton Premium Sliced $4.09. And I think they have Uncured. For well, uncured Hickory Bacon, yeah, $5.39. Right, so they have quite a few different kinds of bacon here too. But it's the, it looks like they're pretty picked over on bacon right now. So, and again, it's one, they, so they got it, they got it, they don't, they don't. Right. Here you go, some marketing from Aldi. Make your own Aldi charcuterie board. An all Aldi charcuterie board. They got meats, they've got uh, varieties of salami, they've got pickles, they've got assorted breads, they've got assorted crackers. Make your own charcuterie board. You know there's an art to that. Yeah, there is, and I have no idea what the art is, to be honest with you. I've never been a fan of charcuterie. But there is an art to that, and I heard people can make a living on this, what I heard. Really? Yes. Making charcuterie boards? Yes, if they're really good at it. Yes, they can. Wow. You want to go down the aisle of shame? Yeah, we could. So we did give in. I just wanted to show them. Yeah. We did buy a roast. And you're going to slice that up into steaks, right? Yes, and freeze them. Um, they're boneless. Right. And we haven't found them at a really good price. The $8.99 is really not a bad price. And this is the half cut strip roast, which is New York strip steak. Right. You know what we need to get though? We need to get a, a chef's knife. I just realized that this week, mm -hmm. a really, really sharp chef's knife. Right. Um, Andy wants to do some cooking with a chef's knife. Chef's, chef's, chef's knife. So this is the, um, it's basically all the fines. They're here today, gone tomorrow. Let's see what's in here today. They have a cat scratch post, cat scratch fever, that, sorry, um, blankets, socks, okay. doggy treats. What's this one here? Children's pajamas. Mm -hmm. Disney oh. princess. Oh, it is a Disney princess. Squad, oh, it's Disney Premium Squad Dolls, $9.99. Oh, they, they have an Olaf. How much is Olaf? I don't know. What's the Olaf price? They've got a uh, Nerf gun, though. $16.99. I don't see an Olaf price. It's a Thai Olaf. Oh, is it? Probably going to be $19.99. Okay, is so it Thai Beanie Booze? Is that a Thai beanie baby boo? It's a Thai, but... Sparkle? I guess that's the... Oh, that's a buddy. Yeah. Beanie buddy? Uh-huh. They got slippers. Oh, they got um, adult family sleep, sleep shirts or pajamas or pants. Need some smartphone cables, honey? They got charging cables. They've got... Uh, I got all those sorts of iPod, iPod, iPad things. Candy canes. And bows. They got bows. Mm -hmm. They do. Well, speaking of bows, um, if you haven't had a chance, do watch our video on how we wrapped presents. 
Yeah. Do you like my way or her way? You have to watch the video to know what I'm talking about. Right. Oh, Disney Reader Link Die Cut Book. Ooh. Hang on, let me look at this. Sorcerer's Apprentice. So this is a Sorcerer's Apprentice. Five ninety nine. Huh. Oh, I like that. I might get this. They have the Lion King too. Uh-huh. They do. They only have the two. These are good for our grandkids. Mm -hmm. Do you want to get them? They only have one Lion King. They got three Sorcerer's mm -hmm. Apprentice. Yay or nay? I don't know. Why is it? Is it called die cut? Why is it called front, because of the oh, front. Oh, is that what it is? Because of the front. Oh, is that why it's called a die cut? I yeah. couldn't figure that out. Because of the front. Oh. Huh. Yay or nay? No, not yet. Okay. But they do have Star Wars, Mandalorian, something I didn't expect to find here. Baby Yoda. Mm-hmm. How about a four-foot inflatable LED Christmas tree or LED Santa? Only thirteen bucks. Mm -hmm. You know the best, what? the best Christmas decoration I've seen concerning Star Wars what? is the inflatable Yoda. Is it surrounded by deflated stormtroopers? Oh, that's hilarious! It's funny. I do like that. Gift boxes. Tape, not much, but they have tape. Well, they want something. Okay, what's on this side? Yeah, let's go down this side. Wow, we actually could use one of these. We have one we use right now, a mechanical timer. Mm -hmm. We have another one, honey. We have a photo cell dust to dawn timer that's outside use. Mm -hmm. Those are only eight bucks. That's not a bad price. And they do have, you know what they have? New Year's Eve stuff. That's something different I don't expect here. It's, uh, at least it doesn't say 2021 on it. It says 2022. I know, I was making a joke. Lots of outdoor items. Outdoor. Yeah, this for, for outdoor lighting for if you want to decorate outdoor mm -hmm. lighting. Right. We have a bunch of that already. Right, more Christmas stuff. Mm -hmm. The Huntington six-piece comforter and comforter set for $49.99. Honey, what? baby, it's cold outside. What you don't song is song? that from? Yeah. And who sang it first? I don't know who. Everybody and their brother is singing it nowadays, but who sang it first? Baby, it's cold outside. Wasn't me. I didn't sing it first. D. Martin. Was it? D. Martin. Wow. It was in a movie. He was part of the Rat Pack. Yes, he was. Wasn't he? Him, Sammy Davis Jr. Um, who else was part of that? I just remember him and Sammy Davis Jr. I think there was four all together. So who else is part of the Rat Pack? If you guys know, put that in the comments below. Leggings, women's leggings. Men's sleep pants. <laughs> men's boxers. No, I'm sorry. Merry Moments Christmas boxers. There you go. Merry Moments Christmas children's pajamas. PJs. More Huntington uh, home collapsible. They have a bunch of frozen stuff. Ooh. Including uh, slippers and uh, dress-up gowns. Oh no, these are dress-up shoes. These are Is actually it? shoes. I did read something. If you want to, um, I did read something about Disney coming up. What? I was mentioning that to you since we are speaking of Disney. Is that um, they're giving an extra half an hour for people who stay on the grounds. Really? So instead of a half an hour, you get an extra hour of staying on the grounds this week. So before everybody else comes in. Right. That actually helped us out when we went last time because we got into. Uh -huh. uh, uh, Mickey and Minnie's train ride or whatever right. they call it the, uh, at uh, Hollywood Studios. Right, and I also read that they were moving some items that was in Lightning Lane into Genie Plus. So okay. there's very few Lightning Lanes you have to buy. Thank goodness. Thank God for that. Want a dartboard? Magnetic dartboard. That would be a cool gift for someone. It's uh, $9.99. Yeah, that's a good price for that one. Is this light bright? Is this like light bright? That is a keyboard. Oh, it's a lighted keyboard. Right. How much is that? It doesn't have a price on it. There's no price on that. It's a gaming keyboard. Wow. 
Oh, we can't forget this. I love this. Oh, the uh, chess set, the yes. 12 classic games, chess, checkers, backgammon. And that was only $16.99. Good price on that. Board games are making a comeback, by the way. Mm -hmm. hmm. Inflatable bed. Is this? What is this? It's, it's a, a kid's a, travel bed. It's oh, an inflatable bed set. That's pretty cool. Yeah. That's $29.99. Yeah. There you go, strainer set. That is pretty cool. I do like that. Did we not buy one for Andy? Yes, we did. Yeah, we got one for Andy already. Oh, I like that. This is um, great. Different set. Yeah, and that's what we, we didn't buy that one, but we bought one already for right. Andy. We've got it already. And there's also measuring cups here. I saw that. Are those Pyrex or just regular ones? Those are Crofton. That must be their name brand. Okay. Laundry baskets. I love laundry baskets. What's that say? Irony uh, Irony is the opposite of wrinkly. Oh. Uh, I had to, I couldn't read that. Umbrellas for six ninety nine. That's not a bad price for an umbrella if you think about it. These are the hottest things. Home sweet home. Yeah, these oh, are nineteen ninety nine. They're porch signs. Yeah. That's and not I've a bad seen price. them. So what other signs are there? Is this is home just sweet the home? two. That's just the home sweet home, and, and what's then the, the other end? one. Oh hello. Oh hello. Okay. Yeah, I think this one. Yeah. Oh hello. Yeah. Okay. There's only two two different sayings. But it is nineteen ninety nine. There's seventy two inches. So 72 inches is six feet? Six feet, yeah. And then if you have a garden, winter protection greenhouse for $49.99. Is that right? No, it's $9.99. $9.99, yes. Normally $29.99. Yeah, the deck box is what is back here. This deck box in the back, that's okay. the that's what's 50 bucks. That's what's okay. $49.99. And there you go, the Isle of uh, Shame. And again, that's just... Everybody calls it that. It's not a slam on what right. it is. It's all defines. Mm -hmm. But if it's here, it's gone. Once it's gone, it's gone. They have Sweet Baby Ray's. All right, we were talking about this because we just bought two of them. But that's only the honey barbecue sauce. Right. Uh, well, oh, they got the regular one back there, too. Two sixty seven. Huh. What did we pay for ours at uh, Sam's Club? Do you remember? Five eighteen for two. Okay, so two sixty seven. Two sixty seven is five. 534. I think um, it was bigger though. Mm -hmm. So. Somebody mentioned in one of our videos that Aldi's had duck and they do. Maple Leaf Farms boneless duck breast. Maple Leaf Farms, by the way, is from right here in northern Indiana. Is it? Yeah, it's uh, over in, uh, oh, just outside of Warsaw, Indiana. Is it? Yeah. Wow. So that's a locally sourced duck. The Maple, Leaf, or the Maple Leaf Farms, anyway. Did you want to see if they had turkey burgers here? Yeah. Um, turkey burgers or the steam plans. Remember, Andy loved the steam plans when we got them around to They would have been right here. And I don't see them. They have sea scallops. Let's look down the other side and see if anything's down the other side. The other day, the other day we were having dinner and mom decided to do chicken nuggets. And Andy comes up from the basement and all he says is, I was thinking about chicken nuggets all day long. Great idea. Five ninety nine. So good. So good. For 48 ounces. They have chicken patties. I don't see turkey burgers. But this is a bad price either because this is the family pack. Eight pounds of boneless, skinless chicken breast for fifteen ninety nine. So it is two dollars a pound. Nope, what's this? I just I'm having trouble finding that. But I want to tell you the ham here is a really good price. It is 85 cents a pound. That's the Appleton Farms spiral sliced ham. Mm -hmm. And it does come with a glaze. 
and the butt portion is $1.49, but this is the one on sale, so. Not a bad price. I think that's it. You might, we'll look over here. I'm still trying to find your turkey burgers. I just can't find turkey. I do not see turkey burgers, huh? Turkey burgers. I see a lot of chicken. I at least see a lot of beef. I do not see turkey burgers. You might be SOL on your turkey burgers, honey. Oh, well. Hmm. We'll keep looking, though. They have veggie burgers. They do. Yeah. They don't have turkey burgers. Gonna wrap things up here at Aldi today. Uh, we did miss an aisle, honey. I realized that as we came out. I guess what, we can come back. Yeah, we, uh, we can come back, to be honest with you. We can come back several times. Um, hopefully we highlighted a couple of things that are really cool, especially the bacon. Um, a lot of people have asked us to start comparing bacon prices, and we have in our last couple of videos, we've looked at bacon prices. But the lower salt bacon here at uh, at Aldi's is really, really good. We've been getting the, over the years, the lower salt bacon from Costco, the Kirkland bacon. Haven't been able to find it here, so we've been trying other lower salt bacon. And the lower salt bacon here is actually really good. And it's good price, too. What was it, 409 Yes, 409 So I remember that. Um, good price for the uh, lower salt bacon. Wrapping things up here at Aldi's. Thanks for watching with us. Uh, thanks for sharing our trip with uh, with us. We appreciate it. Make sure if you've not hit that subscribe button below, please do so. Also, the bell notification button below. That notifies you when we put up future videos. Love, love, love for you to hit the like button too because that'll help us out immensely. Thanks for watching. Hopefully, we can save you a little bit of money here at Aldi today and have a magical day.